Twitter had me under some weird impression that uh, another trailer dropped today, but... Looks like this guy's bio's up. Finally, finally, finally. All right, let's see who Gears officially is in Mortal Kombat 1. I was getting real excited. I was like, yo, we have another trailer. We have another trailer. They're, they're picking things up here. And then we have this. So this is better than nothing. And I really want to know who Gears really is here. So let's, let's get down to the nitty gritty. Sentinel of the Hourglass, Gearus. Reconstructed by Liu Kang at the dawn of his new era, Gearus remains eternal, very cool, and unkillable. Wow. Wow, that's Gearus. He retains the memories of all the innumerable timelines he has watched pass and fade. So other than Liu Kang, he remembers what happened. He doesn't, he doesn't come off fresh like everybody else. In this new era, Gearus monitors events to make sure that they are faithful to Liu Kang's vision. So he is um, carrying out Liu Kang's wishes. That's real cool. Gearus is a good guy. I like it. I really like that. When they deviate from their intended path, it is Gearus' responsibility to correct them. Wow, so he's like the, I don't want to say enforcer, but like watcher. Real cool, so he has a much better purpose now. I feel like before he was like Kronika's, she was treating him like he's some goon, like robot, that's supposed to do, follow her orders. Excuse me guys. While Liu Kang treats him like a friend, which is, that's awesome. That's really cool. <clears throat> As threats to begin to mount, Gears works tirelessly to defend reality. He's fighting off the bad guys, but to succeed, he must first identify the mastermind behind the plot to destroy Liu Kang's new era, which I'm dying to know who it is too. Who, all right, here's my question. My biggest, biggest question here. The good guy team is looking really, really cool right now and really strong, like stronger than it's ever been. Listen. We have Fire God Liu Kang, we have Bihan's Sub-Zero, we have Kwai Lang Scorpion, we have Raiden, we have Kung Lao, who else do we have? We have Kenshi, and we have Gearus, and Gearus is like God level strong. He, I mean, the only, from MK11, the only person that was really able to beat him one-on-one -on -one was Raiden. So, with this kind of good guy team, who the hell is the bad guy team that's going to be a huge threat? It has to be, there's no way it's Shang Tsung. Shang Tsung can't do anything against even Gearus alone. Uh, it took Fujin, Shang Tsung, and Nightwolf to fight off Gearus. So, it has to be Onaga. It has to, has to, has to be Onaga. Um... The main bad guy, uh, not even Khan, Shao Khan, or Shao Khan's not even Khan. Maybe Shao, General Shao is not as powerful as he was when he's Khan. So I'm dying to know. Let me know who you think it is. Uh, leave a comment, like, subscribe. Keep this hype going, man. MK, they're showing more and more. MK1, road to MK1. All right, guys, see you next video.